Howdy, y'all. Excuse my fingers because I was eating chips. Like, I don't even get my nails done anymore because the last time I got them done, I don't know what chemical they used, but, like, my finger was on fire. Like, I before, how many years? Like, it's been, like... 10 years since I actually went and got my nails done usually I just paint them or do it myself and I'm gonna go back to probably doing that <laughs> because I don't know what the fuck they had in it anyways this is reading for Sean and Camilla uh, look I don't know if I'm saying their name right all right it's pretty much to the it's, it's short and it's to the point but I've already pre-shuffled just to save some time. If you hear some weird sound in the back, that's my fan. My fan, my fan, my fan, my fan. <laughs> All right, y'all. Okay. This energy, like, usually I pull for one person and then I pull for the other person. But with this particular one, I just conserve some energy and I just pull, like, for both at the same time. So, um... What I got was recent breakup, maybe I deserve, I'm tired of the bullshit, I want you now, and I got clone version. Dang, uh, <clears throat> I'm hearing that Britney Spears song in my head, I've been cloned. So is this one of those on again, off again relationships because um, I got Maybe I Deserve. Maybe I Deserve is lyrics to a song. If you look it up, I think it's by Tank. And it's funny because his name is Tank and he Tank. Ain't this the nigga that said something about it's okay to get your salad tossed every once in a while or whatever? Like he said this shit confidently. Like this is shit that heterosexual niggas say. They don't, bro. They don't. But yeah, in a song... It's basically, he feels like maybe he deserves the anguish of his girl cheating. I don't know if the song goes into depth about why he's feeling this way, but we could figure, we could kind of put two and two together, you know what I mean? When somebody feeling like that, it's because what? They're a cheater. So this nigga, this nigga is cheating and he's probably getting his salad tossed. God damn it. That was disgusting when he said that. Like, it just, it made me mad when I seen that. Like, but yeah, anyway... This could represent somebody that cheated in this relationship. And, um, well, maybe it's not a relationship, but it is, but it isn't, but it is, but it isn't, because of a recent breakup, right? Um, and what what did I get? What, what card did I get? Oh, let me explain my clone version, because I keep saying clone. You know, um, there is a song by Eminem where he just might be the next best thing, but not me. What this card represents okay like you know when i do my divine masculine divine feminine and i'm always saying divine masculine going after karmics that you know walk like you talk like you this might be the next best thing but not you you know what i'm saying <laughs> like this is what i mean by clone version so whoever cheated they cheated with somebody that was kind of sort of almost you know exactly like the person that they were with that's fucking stupid, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm not, it's not in me to cheat. It isn't. But that's just weird. It's weird in a lot of ways. Okay. So what I got was a uh, King of Wands energy. And the King of Wands is a person that's charismatic. They're bold. They, you know, they always have the right thing to say. They, they're the decision maker. They have like healthy like a, a you know a healthy amount of confidence you know um but there's some downsides when it comes to being in the king of wands energy i'm hearing leo energy so i don't know but this card actually on it it says scorpio and sagittarius so maybe they could have that in their their chart as well but uh this this could be this could be sean this could be this could definitely be sean like please forgive me y'all because i don't be knowing i don't be knowing their personalities like that like i don't be looking into their life or you know i don't be i don't be knowing shit straight up i don't be knowing a motherfucking thing so <laughs> but yeah anyway the downside to this dude is like or 
I'm saying, I'm saying or chick, I'm sorry. It's not a divine masculine, divine feminine reading. I just did that. Get out of that. Get out of that. Right, right. Okay. When it comes to King of Wands, okay, King of Wands is a person where, let's say y'all in a conversation, right? And they telling you about yourself and I like to do this, I like to do that. And then you add in on the conversation because you're trying to relate to them. And you be like, yeah, you know, I used to do that because da, 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 da. They're like, okay back to me like that's the energy that this is in and it's kind of like very forceful you know what i'm saying like they it's like they force their energy on people that they like i guess and maybe it comes to them natural but yeah who um i believe this is sean and with with uh camellia camille camellia i don't know how to say her name it sounds pretty though i ain't trying to chop and screw the, her name but she is in this energy. I'm leaving. I'm ready to leave. I'm ready to leave a situation or mindset that has not served me and hindered my growth. So, yeah, when I asked the cards, like, who, you know, who cheated or whatever, I got, I got the, who did, who cheated, I got the King of Swords. So, yeah, this King of Wands cheated with this King of Swords. And I don't like who this King, King of Swords is because it's a cutthroat bitch or dude you know what i'm saying i'm here i'm a dude he's a dude so it could have been a dude you know what i'm saying honestly the sex really don't matter the gender don't matter but it's just whoever whoever this person is they cut throat like they wanted to come in between they had happiness this 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 that type of cheating that will have you like on snap or some shit you know what i'm saying ain't nothing worse when a motherfucker cheat than the person that they cheated with is like ah ha I got your man you know what I'm saying ah ha I got your bitch like that will make you want to destroy the freaking planet you know what I'm saying so whoever this is right here they on demon time bro they on demon time and this king of wands this pissed me off this is somebody that is just like they're loyal to their self you know they're they're loyal to their self so with, with future actions it's gonna be like. I don't see this I don't see I don't see them coming together and if they do it don't last you know what I'm saying I don't believe that they should get married I don't believe that they should push forward because if this is on again off again this this is probably two people that still care about and have feelings for one another and they keep trying to make it work but somebody can't get over the cheating you know what I'm saying like once somebody cheat the trust is gone or whatever I don't know I'm hearing drums I might be from next door but uh once somebody cheat this shit is done son you know what i'm saying like this shit f motherfucking done because like you you could earn a person's trust back you know what i'm saying but that shit is gonna take forever 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 you know what i'm saying i'm echoing because you know eternity but what i got for them is the nine of um the nine of swords so she feeling like I, I heard humiliation ritual she's feeling like she's embarrassed you know how could he do this to me this shit went public you know what i'm saying like this is just is i don't know why i heard humiliation ritual but it's just this is so sad <laughs> this is so sad hold on let me see if i can get like i because this is it's too it's too too negative too ugh, it irks me to have a broken heart like this i'm going to my witch's tarot deck and i'm just gonna like forgive me when it comes to oracles y'all i don't really pull oracle decks because i'm not that great with them i'm not great at all you know what i'm saying I'm not that good so i you know i know where my strengths and weaknesses are in tarot and i try to give y'all all my strengths you know every now and then i'll be a weak bitch you know what i'm saying <laughs> but uh <laughs> let me let me see I just gotta get, I just get something spiritual, something to ease all of this pain, cause this is fucked up. Cause it's like, it's giving off, yeah, I did it and what? Damn. Like, really? Okay. I got the cow. May the embrace of all that is nurturing awaken in you. What? The fuck, bro? Can I not read? Okay. <laughs> it's, it's this card. I'm sorry about the glare. It say may the em may the embrace what may the embrace of all that's in nurturing 
you awaken and all that you are becoming see this is why i pulled this motherfucking shit man it's trying too hard to be fucking deep like what 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 the fuck like anyways what i can sense from the car is basically it's just knowing when to let go you see you see at the top all of that 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 black and that shit like this is what she what this is what she's going through right now this is what they are going through right now i don't even know what oh shit i was gonna say i don't know what the cow represents but spirit just said why buy the cow when you could get the milk for free god damn <laughs> like i'm not trying to lie but i promise like i promise i promise i was trying to make this shit like more positive and it just keeps getting worse and worse and worse so you know what i'm saying let me put some crystals out or something like spray some incense because this is this is bad bro this is like so you know what i mean how this shit got dusty how it got dusty i don't know but yeah let me let me go ahead and end it it's <laughs> because it's I, I tried to end it on a positive note y'all i really really did all right but till next time love y'all bye